Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name's Benson. What's yours? So, I'm going to show you guys some stuff. We went to the Disney store for the 90th anniversary of Mickey Mouse and got the special um, key that they had. It was a uh, spend anything. Didn't even have to be a certain amount to get the special key. So, I'm going to show you the, the two things we picked up because we both ended up with a key. So, we had to do two separate transactions. And then a movie that we got in the mail that I'm kind of excited about. And some buttons that we got from the Disney store as well. Was Kristen picked up this Edna Mode cup. This was actually on sale for five dollars, um, and so you get the cup and a saucer. So that's what it looks like. I would show it to you, except she took it out of the box, and I don't know where it's at. And then I picked this up, which I thought was super cute. So it's this leather-bound journal. Uh, it comes with a pen, but. It's got the animator uh, drawing of Tangled on it, of Rapunzel. So it's a really nice, sturdy leather book. Uh, it's got a magnetic clasp on it. Not magnetic, it's got a button clasp um, on it. And then the pages on the inside, on one corner it's got the floating lantern lights, and then on the other page in the bottom corner it's got her tower with some of the lantern lights on it as well. And I love the animator style um, for Rapunzel. You got one of these buttons whenever you checked out. And then the main event, the reason we took the hour drive to the Disney store on Mickey's 90th anniversary, 90th birthday, was whenever you open the Disney store, if you're one of the first people there and you get selected to do the whole special opening, you get a replica of the key that they use to open the Disney store. And it's this giant, like, four-foot key, and it's the key to imagination, and there's a lock and everything, and it's a really cool ceremony. If you've never done it, I really suggest you check it out. Uh, we did do it with the kids one time. We've actually done it with a couple times. If you can see right there, there's keys hanging right there um, on the shelf here. So they're just the standard like green key that um, it looks like an exact replica. So what this is though is this is a replica of those but it's done in the colors of Mickey Mouse. So that's what it looks like. So you can see it's got Mickey Mouse ears on the, on the main piece here. And then if you turn this upside down, or yeah, upside down, it looks like a castle and it's painted in yellow. So they're just the Mickey Mouse colors. The first 90 guests got one. Uh, we did show up about uh, two hours early, not on purpose. I actually forgot that on Sundays the Disney store opens at 11 instead of 10. So that was actually my bad. Otherwise, we'd have showed up closer to 11 than we actually did. And I think they may have passed out like 30 tickets by then. Uh, this wasn't really a well-announced um item or giveaway and the Disney store is pretty prone to that. Uh, some interesting updates that we did find. So I've been telling you for the last eight, nine months that the Mickey Memories, our store only gets 12. We'll come to find out that for the last two months where we stayed home and ordered online, the store has gotten 24. So when we showed up on Sunday, the day after Mickey Memories released, they still had plushes, pens, and cups in the shop. So we could have just went out picked them up from the store without having to pay shipping but i mean they literally waited until i guess october and november to actually double the shipment that the store got so that's just that's really some bad bad business on disney's part just because they should have been doing 24 all along and you wouldn't have had people having to get there the night before because they were only getting 12 so that was a little upsetting to see, and I'm sure next month they'll do the same thing, but honestly, next month I'll probably just order them online again, because I set my alarm for 2.30, got up, ordered them at 3, and then could go right back to bed. I didn't, because I'm a bad person. But I could have, if I wanted to. Again, that was just something that kind of like, it really kind of burned my biscuit a little bit, you know, because it's like, it's so frustrating having dealt with it for nine months, and then all of a sudden they, change the route they want to take with three months left so whatever you know I still need to order last month's pens and this month's pens to for the giveaway at the end of the year so maybe next month I'll actually go show up on a Saturday just to at least pick up the pens but anyways that's Mickey memories over 
So the movie we picked up, we didn't even pick this movie up. We actually ordered it from the Disney Movie Club. We are Disney Movie Club members. And if you guys want to or are interested in the Disney Movie Club, you've never done it. I'm going to put a link in the description. If you follow that link, basically if you sign up from that link, we get two free movies. So you don't have to. It's not a sponsor or anything like that. It's just something kind of cool. But anyway, so we got Ant-Man and the Wasp. And if you look, they have this special hologram cover where their helmets come off. So I thought that was kind of cool. Um, it's really neat. I really like this movie. I like both the movies. And actually when we ordered it from the Disney Movie Club, we actually got Ant-Man and Ant-Man and the Wasp um, as a single purchase. And so we were pretty excited about that. We uh, we love these movies. They're some of our favorite Marvel movies. They're just, they're funny and they've got action and stuff like that. Uh, what's cool with these though is like with any Disney Movie Club, they usually have some kind of like extra thing they send so like this one you've got ant-man and ant-man and the wasp it also came with a lithograph there's the lithograph that it came with and if you've seen ant-man and the wasp you know that he um that the character of ant-man he was in prison at one point and so after he gets out in this movie i believe it was this movie they started it they started a security company called XCon Security, and this movie purchase actually came with a little patch for like a backpack or something that says XCon Security, and I actually used it on my new book bag to cover up my works logo because I use that book bag everywhere. I don't want my work logo to kind of be attached to it, um, and so I use it to cover it up. So it's pretty neat looking. And that's just some kind of the cool perks that Disney Movie Club does. Um, usually around the holidays, you can order from them. And then for like an extra dollar, get like a cool little um, ornament that they have and stuff. So that's why we like the Disney Movie Club. It's actually, I think, our third or fourth go around through them. Because once you get the VIP status and you've, you've bought your selected amount that you have to buy within so many years... Uh, you can actually restart the service and get like, you know, five movies for a dollar plus shipping. And then you just have to buy so many movies again in two weeks or two years. So that's just something we enjoy doing. So if you're interested, I'll put our link down below and you can click it. And then if you end up do signing up, we get two free movies, which is cool for us. Because we're trying to collect all the Marvel movies and, you know, the Disney movies and stuff like that. So just thought I'd share that with you. I thought it was kind of neat. Kind of neat. Uh, so while I have you and we're talking Disney, uh, December the 1st through the 5th, I will be in Orlando with the Disney to Distance podcast group. Most of us are going to be in Orlando during that time. Um, there are a few that can't make it, but we're going to do something the following year with those people. So that's going to be awesome. But anyway, so December 1st through the 5th, um, I will be in Orlando at the parks doing all kinds of crazy stuff. So if you're in Orlando during that time and you want to meet up, you want to hang out, you want to say, hey, or you see the hat by all means say hello i think that'd be totally awesome you may be the first person to recognize me that watches these videos and for me that might make me cry a little bit because that's going to be super cool whenever it happens but anyways uh and then the first and the second or the first second and third kristen and the kids will be there so you get to meet kristen if if you see us um and I think tentatively on the first, we're going to be in Hollywood Studios. And then honestly, after that, I don't know. It's going to be chaos because there are like six different people trying to coordinate to hang out with each other and still spend time, you know, doing their own thing. So again, December the 1st through the 5th, if you're in Orlando, please let me know. And if you see me, you see the hat, come say hey. It'll be awesome. I love you guys. And I hope you enjoy these videos. I know I've kind of been lacking lately. I'm not getting one out every day. It's just, it's just, it's just some crazy things. I changed jobs. Not companies, but I changed positions. And then I'm trying to adjust to that. And just all the craziness. Uh, and we recently just got a new dog. And she's great. But she's kind of crazy at the same time. So it's adjusting to that style. But um, yeah. Yeah. We love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Till tomorrow.